Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Oh look at that on my save file. My lives appear to be maxed out with the goldenness of sorts. But anyway, I guess that 40 on there is the exit count that I found and whatnot, similar to the number in Super Mario World. So let's go find some more exits and continue the game of course. Next level is Prickly Goombas! Are they gonna have like spiky helmets or something like that? Or maybe it's going to be a Goomba plus Spike combo. Oh, it's a new music, isn't it? Anyway, I gotta check pipes just to be sure I don't miss stuff. I gotta get items to also make sure I don't miss... Oh, these kinds of Goombas. Yeah, they, they're in these spiky eggs and they get released when you spray them with... I mean, shoot them with fire. Like that. <laughs> oh shoot, didn't mean to do that. But whatever. And yeah, the, they can be awakened by the piranha plants as well as your fireball, so that's probably why they gave you uh, the fireball earlier. And what what are you? Are you just like a, a regular... well... Oh, you, you seem to be more proficient with your aiming than other piranhas, right? No, you're not. <laughs> you seem to aim directly for that Goomba, so... Yeah, well. Oh, what? <laughs> why did I think that would work? <laughs> you know, I should really wait on these wheels a little longer, like, to see if there's any sort of hidden pipe or something like that, because you know on the original game they had that sort of thing. These land wheels of sorts. And yeah, I see you peeking out of there. Oh, oh. You. Hit that. Hit that. No. <laughs> I wouldn't mind taking a hit, really, if, you know, I can just rush into that pipe, because I'm pretty sure that pipe's gonna have something. Oh, come on. <laughs> mm, up here. Think that worked? Yes! And now they will flop down one at a time. I figured that would work if you didn't have a fire flower. It seemed a little unreasonable that they would make you keep a fire flower the whole time. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> uh, oh, okay, I was gonna say. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, let me get back up there. It's slightly slippery. There we go. Is there more on? Yeah, there is more on the other side. Is there... How did I miss those coin blocks on my first time around, anyway? Is there more on the upper levels? Like, if I were to... No? Just those three and on each side? Well, okay. <laughs> well, that's apparently the first star coin. And... Midpoints! And this wheel is pretty huge. This land ice wheel. Wait a second, is something here? Yes, there is. It just seemed like there would be, but based on the little... Ooh! Based on the little alcove that was there. Ooh! Wait a second, what, is it gonna be something up there? I don't know. <laughs> uh, hmm. I see that they uh, made sure to have a lot of fire in this level so that the Goombas could be born out of their spiky prisons. And... let's see what's up here. Hopefully a star coin? Oh, there is. Um... Hold on a sec. <laughs> I want to... Yeah, there we go. That's what I want to do. I just want to clear the way by bouncing my fireballs across there and then... Uh! And now I got to carefully get back to the other side good. <laughs> and... Oh wait, this one you go in. Okay. That makes sense. Come in through the green one, exit the yellow one. Um... Can I eat them? No, I can't eat them in their spiky form. I can eat them when the Goombas are born, of course. Uh, I know I can eat the piranha plants, because they are a delicious salad. A delicacy. <laughs> I didn't know if you would get fire if you'd eat a piranha plant, actually. I thought it only when you eat their fireballs. Um, why are they down there? Are they supposed to, like... Oh yeah, they get born up there, that makes sense. Okay, because that, that prana plant, or I mean, uh, you know, is supposed to make them pop out and surprise you, per se. Yeah, okay, dokie. Well, anyway, I got all the star coins, but it still can help but feel that I would like to explore the secrets of the world, I suppose. And even though I... Whoa, boy! No, 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 no! Thank you, Yoshi! Why do you get so frightened when you take a hit? I don't do that when I take a hit. And I'm incredibly delicate. The slightest brush against any anything makes me take a hit. 
Seriously, if you bump into anything, like enemies and stuff like that, just knocks the wind right out of you, apparently. <laughs> I don't really feel like checking all those pipes, especially with all the piranhas in the way. Oh, this is actually kind of dangerous, or maybe not. Is there anything that would indicate that there is a secret? I don't know, but I didn't really get much speed on that jump, did I? Despite the speed of this land wheel. Uh, there we go. I hope I found everything. <laughs> Now that I know the game has secret exits, you know, yeah. <laughs> anyway, let's go to the next level, and I kind of want that acorn. But I bet you when I grab it, I'll be bumped by the penguin. But I'll go in here first just to see what kind of mini game this life also has. Another one of these, huh? Oh, fine. <laughs> Bring it on, even though I got 99 lives. And I can't increase my lives any lo anymore, or, oh shoot, or at least I assume I can't. So, it doesn't really matter what the outcome of this one is, will it? Like, because even if I don't get any lives out of this, you know, it's still not going to make any difference. And I, even if I collect a bunch of coins, it's still not going to make any difference. Oh, geez, I'm really failing now. <laughs> oh, and I managed to land on one. Oh, whatever. Well, that's going to be terrible. Yeah. But I got a ton of coins. Not that pocket change matters. <laughs> but yeah. Well, that was fun, I suppose. Alright, let's get that acorn. Yep, that's what I thought would happen. <laughs> There's no way to do it otherwise. You know what? Haha. Uh -huh. <laughs> Knocking the sunglasses right off of you. Whoop. Voila. And deal with it, bro. <laughs> I thought that was fitting with the sunglasses, but whatever. Now for my acorn. No, pff, or not. I'd like to drop, yeah, that. I figured I could do that. Don't really care for the start. Wait a second. Hey, 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 come back here. <laughs> I will head you off the pass if need be. Yep. My uh, inventory is getting full of really good items. <laughs> what is this? It's an act. It's an optional. Oh no, it's not optional. It's these paths right here. I can't move to the right and I can't move to the left. They're blocked off. So that one is five. The other one's four. I'm guessing that one unlocks the lower path. This one unlocks the uh, higher path on the ring. Scaling the mountains. Oh, aren't you a cute little squirrel? But well, now you're dead. That's not cute at all. <laughs> Wait a second, do I want that to free stuff in this bullet bill level of sorts? I don't know. Maybe. Uh, is there going to be any secret down where those coins are? Maybe. Oh, there is. What if I go on top of them? Will another set... Yes, they will. Interesting. And it's an acorn. It's an acorn. <laughs> Did not expect that, but that's why you kind of go for coins. Just to make sure you find everything. Did I see one up there? Yeah, I did. It's going to be easily collected with that. Whee! Definitely a good power-up right here. <laughs> um, I'm kind of curious to see if there's anything down there. And there's probably something in this cloud. Whee! You can spin to uh, diffuse... Not diffuse. Um, dissipate clouds. So you, can, you can see what's behind them. Hmm. It just looks like there's a bottomless pit there. I best not test it. <laughs> Clouds do seem to reappear after a while, by the way. So I suppose if you uh, uncover something via a cloud, you should... Uh, what the heck? Why is there a coin there? But I suppose if you uh, uncover something via a cloud, you should get to it before it reappears, I suppose, so you know what you're aiming for. But what is the point of that? Is it going to be like... Another hidden thing. Or am I, I going to have to, like, squirrel cling to the wall or something? I I don't know. <laughs> and I'm scared to go down that route because... Okay, there's got to be something there because... Uh, yeah. But what? Why was there a coin over here, though? Is there something I can... Ground pound? No? Well, there's that. Is that what the coin was indicating? If so, that's a terrible prize. <laughs> and 
Anyway, let's go this way. And I get a bunch of coins! Kind of. I mean, I got a couple of coins, but not... Oh no! But not a bunch of them. Double oh no. <laughs> Uh, I definitely want to go up there, so I'm going to way down this side, and... Yeah! That works. Oh, and that's the last star coin. Now I must be careful not to die. <laughs> and I'm going to completely ignore that box, because that's kind of scary. What's in here? Coins. I'm gonna kill you, because you might get in the way. Unless I'm supposed to take you all the way to the goal or, or something. Oh god, that's kind of treacherous. I'm gonna ignore that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bonsai Bill! <laughs> oh, I see where they're popping in that ginormous cannon there. Yeah, but that was just their intro. They weren't really a much of a threat. Bonsai Bills are a lot like regular bullet bills, and then you just jump on them once and they go pop. <laughs> and that's the end of the stage. Oh, and I realized that uh, I forgot about that Nabbit back on the other stage over here. I should do that actually while I can. It was back in uh, this world here, I think. Or was it the water world? Unless he disappeared by now, which is always a possibility. <laughs> I just don't remember where... Oh, he was in the water world. Okay, so I'll do this to finish off the part, because I don't think I have enough time for one more level and not... Because I'm still aiming for 15-minute uh, parts and whatnot. Especially since I've been making these parts in HD, and that's... Lovely. <laughs> I didn't think that would pop up that fast, because they made me run for it. Let's try that again. And let's go! I gotta avoid the urchin. <laughs> That's kind of awkward because he gets ahead of me. Uh, great. I didn't press the jump button when I fell off the edge again. <laughs> I am being a pro again. <laughs> ah, I will get your loot. Once I wait for that urchin. <laughs> That, that first urchin is just so awkward on this race of sorts, and wow, you can really jump! <laughs> oh my, I hope I will be able to make it in time. Uh, uh, oh god. Um, I, oh boy. That, this might be a tough one to actually catch up with him. Or maybe not, I don't... Oh god! Oh, I almost had him! Oh! <laughs> Well, maybe it's not impossible once it gets to a certain point in the level, but otherwise he seems to get a, uh... Oh! And he's going to... Another spot? What? Really? Oh, no. Did I just, like, lose him outright? Hmm. If so, that would be kind of sad. <laughs> I mean, he jumped off this, this side. Hmm. Hmm. You can press the L button to check the map, by the way. Um... Wow, this map is a lot more expansive than I thought. Oh my god, there, is... there must have been a secret exit somewhere in this world then. Probably the ghost ship. Because there is a purple mushroom house? What is that? Never seen one of those before. I mean, what? I... Oh man, there's a lot more to this place than I thought there was. <laughs> You guys should be, uh... That's the next world, I guess. You guys should have checked this map earlier to determine where secret exits may be. And there's the Sky World that I unlocked, the secret Sky World. Oh, and yeah, I could also check the, uh, Snow World leading to this place as well if I would have checked the map earlier. Whoopsie! But anyway, I think I'm going to end off this part because it looks like I missed my chance with that Nabbit. do so, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when I go work my way back up to the next level, and hopefully avoid these penguins. <laughs> and...